Hey Psych2Goers, welcome back to another installment of How Do I Know If They Like Me? Asking someone out can be super difficult, mostly because you don't wanna risk being rejected. In 2016, David B. Givens found that physical attraction and seduction are mostly nonverbal. Shocker, no one usually comes out and says they like you, so how do you decode these nonverbal cues? Let's take a look at seven signs someone is attracted to you, and you have no idea. Number one, their body language shifts towards you. Not everything we say is with our words. Our body language plays a big role. For example, let's say you and a friend are sitting side by side watching TV. Is their body facing the TV or angled towards you? Are their arms and legs crossed? If their body is angled towards you with uncrossed arms and legs, this could be a sign that this person may be attracted to you. Bonus points for how close you two are sitting. The closer to the person you're sitting, the more chance they're attracted to you. Number two, they fidget a lot. Let's say you and someone are having a conversation. You start noticing them shifting in their seat, fixing their hair, or playing with things around them. Seems like they might be anxious or something. Now, if you're having lunch or coffee and are not in any danger, what could they be so nervous about? Probably that the person likes you and is just nervous being around you. This can really help tell you if someone is attracted to you. Oh, um, so you noticed the fidgeting. Oh, well, it's because, it's because I have something to say to you. I'm really nervous about saying this, but I've been wanting to ask if, if you could hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would mean a lot. Thanks in advance. Number three, there's a lot of eye contact. When someone's attracted to you, they tend to look at you more often than they would a platonic friend. And not only do they look at you, but they also try to make direct eye contact. When you're looking at just anyone, prolonged eye contact can be a bit uncomfortable. But when it's the right person, you both may find yourselves gazing into each other's eyes. When coupled with smiling and maybe a touch on the arm, this can be a good indicator that someone is attracted to you. Number four, they find ways to accidentally bump into you. You and your crush work in the same office. You know they take their lunch at 12 and you take yours at one. So you time leaving the office just right so you can pass by them and strike up small talk every day. Maybe they find a way to pass your desk on the way from the break room. They're creating opportunities to see and interact with you to create a bond which can potentially grow into more. So it's a big sign that someone's attracted to you. Number five, they find ways to accidentally bump into you literally. There is a very distinct line between platonic and romantic relationships. When someone is physically attracted to you, they'll make excuses to make physical contact. It may be commenting on how soft your sweater is while touching your arm. That extra connection gives a hint that they might wanna be more than friends. If you find yourself in this situation, think about your response. How do you feel when this person touches you? This could help you figure out if this is someone you'd like to go on a date with or someone you need to set a strict boundary with. Number six, they work their relationship status into the conversation. There are two groups of people who love to work their relationship status into the conversation. Newly engaged people and single people talking to their crush. Someone who's single and wants their crush to know will make it known. They don't want any doubt about the fact that they are available. And number seven, they keep in contact with you. When you are attracted to someone, want to get to know someone, or are even in a relationship, you usually talk to the other person the most. If you're curious if someone is attracted to you, take note of how often that person initiates a conversation with you. If they want to talk to you a lot, this could be another big indicator of their attraction to you. So have these signs helped you get an idea of what to look for that indicates someone may be attracted to you? If you know other signs or you've seen these signs in someone you know, let us know in the comments below. Share this video with someone who might like it too. The references and studies used in this video are listed in the description below. As always, take care and thanks for watching. Need to know how to spot an actor from the real deal? Try watching eight signs someone is pretending to like you.